Welcome to No Land Slayoff! Da 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 da! Well, it's the Axis Allies, No Limits Revised, XEG40, House Rules Playtest, Round 1! Hooray! Brought to you by 1945 Music. The bad guys are Sergeant Schultz as Germany and Italy. Crockett, Crockett 36, King of Japan. And me as the rest of the ally, because no one wants to play with me. <laughs> so there's going to be a little, little bit more videos for me. Well, anyways, XEG40 XEG Revise is a uh, revision of my rules that we played the first game here. This is game two of it, of the revisions. And the revisions will be in, uh, in the comment section. I'll send a document uh, tag there. For anybody who wants to see it, XE, XE G40 represents X Banchan and Hands Global 40. This is game two of ours, round one. In my game, China goes first. And so China will have 12 IPCs to spend. I'm spending all of it. And three artilleries. Hooray! <laughs> who needs cavalry or tanks? And the Burma Road is constantly open for the Chinese. But anyway, I'll have one battle to declare around four areas of non combats. So that battle will be in Guangxi against four units of the Japanese. Defending at two each. And let's see how we get this here. All right, that's very good. Good shot. All right. So, from Yunnan, we got four troops that are going to march into there. And then two troops from Hunan going to move into there as well. Six together, but that's not all. It's Flying Tiger from Shechuan. It's going to move two spaces. And I only have two. Left is gas tank, as you see there. So I have six troops and a fighter against his four. Units have defended it too for the Japanese. So I had this all set up. Get this well lit. So these are my six, ja my six Chinese. I had a one. Fighter added three, four black dice, or his defenders added two. All right. I'll need a cup for this. I can just. Ah. Oh, I need two hits at least. Yeah, for my side, of course. I got, hey, I got two hits. I got three hits. How about that? One, two, and three. Yeah, but he got two hits as well. <laughs> Got half hits, unbelievable. Oh well, so so I got three hits, so I'll take out three for him. And take out two for me. So I'll still have four troops. The fighter against his just not destroyer uh, artillery. Let's get to that. He did one hit, and I got it, and he misses. How about that? Nice. I got two hits, actually. Oh, I like it. I like it a lot. So, I'm left with four infantry and a fighter. He, hey, he's bye-bye. Infantry, they're gone. The artillery. Where my troops are going to. So let's get. I go up 13 in the charts. I expect to get it. And Japan goes down to 25. Look at this guy hit me, Ted. <laughs> Alright, so. Uh, four troops in Kuang Si. It's mine. And I'll return this fighter back to Yunnan. Wow. So I'll start from the top. 
these two troops from Suyan will march into Shenxi. <laughs> and this troop from Shenxi, so right in there, is going to march into Shetchuan. <laughs> these two infantry from Kui Chow, Chow Chow Chow, to march in Yunnan. <laughs> and these six troops from Shetchuan. March into Yuna. Hooray! That went pretty well. So, uh, so I'll just. Let's see, so now I'm at 13 in the charts. So I caught 10, 11, 12. 13 plus 6 over here with a Burma Raw being open. Six more. I'll be collecting 19 to spend next turn. Hooray! And of course, I'll put down my three artillery in the Yunnan. Da -da -da -da. Ah, I like it. I like it a lot. So let's do the recap. Okay. Got four troops in Kuangxi. Two troops in Shenxi, one troop in Shechuan, and in Yunnan itself, I got three artilleries, one fighter, and I believe eight troops. Again, eight troops, three artilleries, and one fighter in Yunnan. Hooray! Take that, Crockett, Emperor Crockett. <laughs> so, that should be it. And, hey, I'm under, oh, we have seven minutes right here, so. All right, so stay tuned for Germany's turn left. His Führer Sergeant Schultz will have his Germany's turn. And to just uh, remind you of some of the house rules, Schultz, remember the, the capital ships are not fitted for with AA guns until the second this is the second round of, uh, of, the, of the game. So, yeah, free shot of those capitals of mine. <laughs> so, you don't have to worry about your plays. But, one thing, and of course, don't forget your tech roll if you want it. <laughs> and you'll start with four. I don't know why I, I didn't put it down, but you start with four, four free uh, paratroopers. You don't have to pay for them. Afterwards, you have to pay one IPC each for them. Remember the flight range if you put two on a bomber, the paratroopers. It says in the rules. Okay, for Paris, no doubt attack that. And I'm declaring, um, and remember in our my house rules, on victor, victory cities, which Paris is, I'll have six troops in there, but four of those troops will be at a three, defending at a three. Uh, under my house rules, any uh, infantry is in um, uh, Victory City, that mount, wherever it's about, which is Francis IV, that mount of uh, infantry is Defender at 3. So I have six in there, but four of Defender at 3. So remember that, Schultz? And if you, if you bring in more, if you bring more, if you bring less than three aircrafts into France, I declare my AA gun to be an anti-tank gun because I know you'll have tanks going in there. <laughs> so if you have less than three aircraft coming into France, I declare this AA gun as an anti-tank gun. And remember, the anti-tank gun fires after you make your attacks. So you don't have to worry about your tanks getting blown up and you'll have no chance of attack. So it, on my defense, it, that's when I roll the, roll the dice for my AA gun. Against your tank. It would be an anti-tank gun. So I get three dice against your tanks. For each round of battle. And I declare my anti-tank gun to be taken second to last as casualty. So that would be before my, my French fighter. So remember that. that because... 
anti-tank -tank gun can fire multiple rounds if it survives. So that's why I'm declaring my anti-tank gun. We take a second to last as a casualty. So I can fire multiple rounds at your tanks. I get three tanks, three dice against each tank. All your, ta your, your tanks. I know you're bringing at least six of them in there. <laughs> So, very good. And if you run out of tanks, you fire out your uh, mech infantry, but I don't think it'll come to that. <laughs> so, just remember that. And also, I overhaul the Vichy territory, so you'll see in the rules. Check out in the rules of what I did in the revisions. So, you you probably won't attack any of the Vichy territory, and the, you know, the French territory, because they automatically go Vichy. Once Paris has fallen, and anybody who well, I forgot to put down uh, <laughs> was Eunice for the French in that, in that season, I gotta remember that. So remember that? Uh, Schultz, yeah, it's been going over 11 minutes on my turn. So stay tuned for Schultz's turn in round one of Germany's turn. And Schultz, five to six if you will, and your dice rolls. If you please, and so, no limit out! <laughs> <laughs>